pay to uh, Parliament where there was some kind of drama when the nominee for the local government minister designate was vetted. Now, President of Think Tank Imani Ghana, Franklin Kujo, has asked President Mahama to withdraw the nomination of Nkwanta North Member of Parliament John Bless Oti as Deputy Minister Designate for Local Government. Speaking on uh, City FM, the big issue, City FM's program, the big issue on Saturday, Franklin Kujo argued that Mr. Oti Bless's posture before Parliament Appointment Committee on Friday proved that he was not fit for the position. He questioned the motive behind the nomination. Now, the young unmarried member of parliament who has fathered two children fumbled in answering many pertinent questions thrown at him by committee members, especially when it came to issues of which was his surname, whether Oti Blaise or Blaise Oti. And uh, so we want to take a listen to exactly what Franklin Kujo said. John Oti Blaise. Which is the surname? The surname is Oti. But the way it is arranged is what I'm putting out. Are you a Presbyterian? No, please. Pentecost. John yes, Pentecost. that's my middle name. So, Honorable Chairman, so do we, do we amend your presentation? Because your presentation to us is Honorable Oti Bless John. Should we keep it like this or we should... We should do it, bless O.T. John. I mean, we want clarity, please. No, the arrangement should be John O.T. Bless. Look, let's find out from you. Let's find out from you. What is your surname? What is the last name? It's O.T. O.T. So it should be John Bless O.T. Right. Thank you, Mr. Yes. Chairman. Yes. So, 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 so in that case, uh, Honorable Chairman, we'll maintain what is Very well, very well. We'll maintain now what let's, is Now, let's, he has, still, he has told us that the surname is O.T. Yes, please. So the surname being Oti, that should be the last name that should appear. John and Bless will come before Oti. Honorable what it means is that you said to us that we should then therefore allow this. We cannot allow this because he is informing us that the surname is Oti. So if he wants to put out the name, the full complement then, beginning with Oti then as a surname, the second name or the given name then will be John Blake. All right, so we've been joined on the line by the gentleman in question, Mr. John Bless Oti. Uh, good afternoon, sir. Thank you very much for your time. Uh, fine afternoon, my brother. I believe I got the pronunciation and arrangement of your name right. Well, I, 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 I couldn't hear what you, you so I, I, I'm, I'm guessing it should be John Bless Oti. Yeah, exactly. Sure. Okay. What, what do you make of suggestions or calls uh, on the president that he should withdraw your nomination? Have you had some of these calls yourself? Yeah, thank, you, thank you, my brother. I don't know. Well, uh, I read a couple of uh, uh, things like that yesterday on the net which um, uh, one of them was uh, uh, said by one, uh, what's the name, uh, Franklin Kuju of Imani. Yes. Yes. Uh, my brother, <laughs> I, I am surprised. And what I would say is uh, uh, Franklin Kuju of Imani is, 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 hasn't been fair to me. Why would you say that? Oh. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. I am go ahead. No, I'm asking why are you saying he's not been fair to you? He's not been fair to me in the sense that what he said was not what exactly happened at a vetting during the vetting uh, in, in Parliament on Friday. You understand? Mm -hmm. Because if 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 he if Franklin Kujo really watched what transpired on Friday. I don't think he'll be seeing all the things he's uh, reported to have heard about me. But anyway, I don't, I don't blame him for that. I don't begrudge, begrudge him. I, I think that he's entitled to his opinion. 
But but you yes. see, he, um, Mr. Franklin Kujo is not the only one who has raised concerns with your performance when you met the the Parliamentary Select Committee uh, on, on 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 the vetting the vetting committee in Parliament. Also, uh, Kwame Ameto, uh, who is a staunch NDC legal member, thought that your performance was woeful. So it's not only uh, Franklin Kujo. There seem to be this other leading member of the NDC who thinks that your nomination was highly questionable. My, my brother, I don't think uh, uh, one's performance at the uh, vetting uh, has anything to do with his ability to deliver on the job. You understand? I don't think... But, but uh, vetting, like is, supposed said, to, vetting is supposed to gauge your competence. performance whatever at the vetting is a measure, you understand, Right. to my, my ability to perform. Okay. If, if, if I were a family member of uh, Frank, uh, Franklin Kujo, and uh, whoever you're mentioning, I think they, 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 they would have been proud of me. But we, should, we, should, we should learn to look at people's track record. Mm. You understand? People's track uh, record. But, but Mr. 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 T. In, 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 instead of pettiness. Okay, Mr. T. In this country, we're in this country. We witnessed a number of people during MPP who appeared before vetting committees. Some were professors, PhD holders. We all saw what happened. Mr. So T, they, if, they, if you are to rate yourself, if you are to rate yourself on a scale of zero to ten, what would you, what mark would you give yourself in terms of your performance? I can, I can, I can write an exam and mark myself. You understand? Hmm. But, but would you, would were you satisfied with your performance? You say? Were you satisfied with your performance? My brother, ask you what? I believe you watch the vetting. I did. Tell me which single question. Which single question I failed to answer accurately with regards to my, 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 my dedicated uh, uh, job? Mm. Yes. So you, 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 you are sure that you performed quite well? My brother, my brother like I said, you see, I don't, I, don't, I don't have to be, I mean, arguing with you on this issue. Mm. You understand? Right. It has nothing to do with my ability to perform, like I said. See, that is why Africa and uh, Ghanaians, we don't, we don't develop, we don't progress. Because we, we seem to be worshipping big, big, big grammar, English, and a uh, uh, fast, fast certificate. All right. Um, Ms. Oti, my final, question, my final question to you would have to do with um, uh, the issue of your surname. Clearly, it has been quite debatable. For clarity, we at a point also the name Kwabna came in the list of names that were mentioned. If you can, just for clarity and for record purposes, mention your that, full name as it should appear uh, when at least we are addressing you. My brother, I think uh, uh, it was put out there and everybody knows or wherever I have worked, I have been an assembly no, member in Accra. As I speak with you, my brother, mm -hmm. I have three companies. I have workers working under me. We, we are not, we are not doubting business. your credentials. We just want clarity so that at least as a media house, when we are addressing you, we know how to position each of the names. My brother, that as, you a member, as a media house, you know the names of every member of parliament in Ghana. So you don't we, need to ask. The initial name we, we got for you was John Bless Oti. Is that it? My brother. And then in you, Parliament, too, there was John Bless, Kwabna Oti. There was, so we just want clarification. And we need you to help us just know how the arrangement brother, is. All those names are still the same names. They, all the names you are mentioning mm -hmm. are the same, the same names. You understand? Okay. You understand? Don't be, don't be mischievous. You understand? All right. I don't know why in Ghana we, we seem to be doing politics negatively. You understand? It, okay. It help us. We thank you. We you thank have, you very much yeah, for... Thank you so much. I believe you are a journalist. One last word. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Look, what I want you to be doing as a journalist is to dig properly into people's background. Mm. You understand? And what they've been able to do in their private lives. Okay. You understand? Yes. What they've been able to do in their private lives before you come out and comment on some pettiness and political propaganda that's been put out there by some people. You understand? I'm a credible, genuine, decisive, firm, bold young man. I think Franklin Kujo would be proud of me if I were his family member. Okay? Franklin Kujo, all right. Thank you so much. We thank you for your uh, 
for answering our call and speaking to us. John Bless Oti um, is Deputy Minister for Local Government Designate, and uh, he met Parliament's Vetting Committee on Friday. There are calls for him to be uh, his resig his um, uh, nomination to be rescinded by the president uh, because of what some people say was a poor performance when he met the vetting committee. One of the key issues that came up strongly was the arrangement of his name. But he is raising concerns saying that the arrangement of his name should not uh, you know, be uh, a measuring tool as to how his performance would be.